this approach to looking at the fascial system was developed basically by myself, a manual therapist who was frustrated with people who didn't get all the way better with the approach that we have uh, at our, our disposal to begin with. The articular approach along with exercise, very effective, very potent, really still use it all the time, but it seemed to be there were people that were not all the way better or weren't staying better. So looking at the background that I came from was one of the articular system and uh, using exercises, motor control and that sort of thing. Well, they are very potent approaches and I still use them all the time. It looks as though supplementing the soft tissue type of uh, work seems to, to have a great deal to offer this group of people. What I realized is if I were able to reposition the body and then search out areas of restriction, uh, I was able to find that there were areas that were uh, engaged when the body parts were put in positions relative to one another, that you could identify areas of restriction that didn't follow the articular planes, that once uh, released, were, uh, there was a huge change in people's pain level and their functional level. So by looking at uh, the fascial system and being able to engage the planes of fascia, being able to identify areas of tightness and restriction, freeing that up, I found that my clinical results have improved quite dramatically. Now this has got applicability for right through from people that are old and frail and you sure wouldn't want to be manipulating their spines, um, right through uh, all of the kinds of people that we see in addition to the high level athlete where you know with the, the kind of work they're doing, they're, they're working their soft tissues to such a degree that they develop um, restrictions that once uh, are freed up they're able to get a higher level of performance. It's something that can be quite easily applied for because uh, it's basically using manual therapy techniques um, and just simply repositioning the body to engage the fascial planes and uh, therefore people are uh, giving me feedback that they're able to apply it uh, right away on Monday morning because it's using techniques they already have in their toolkit and it's just applying principles that are quite easily downloadable if you will.